The Popcorn Kids is the only program in New Jersey that teaches true black history mm. at the Irvington Library. Their trademark is the um, practicing of Kwanzaa every month of the year. Um, also, we have been honored by the city of Irvington and the state senate. And um, at the Popcorn Kids, children really do have a voice. Ah. I'm going to share two poems with you guys today. And I'm going to dedicate one to um, Martin Luther King and the other one to the struggle that we're still in. So the first one is called No Justice, No Peace. And this poem was dedicated to Trayvon Martin at the time when Trayvon Martin was killed. But since then, the list has grown longer. So I dedicate this poem to all of the people that have been killed by police or wannabe police. <laughs> no justice, no peace. Young 17-year-old slain, shot dead in the street. And all he had was some Skittles and a can of tea. America, I thought, was supposed to be the land of the free. I guess not if you're young and black and wear a hoodie. No justice. She holds her head in her hands. Tears stain her face. She won't eat nor sleep. The floor she paced. Eyes bloodshot red from sleepless nights. Until her young son gets justice, she will continue to fight. No peace. We didn't have to know him to fight on his behalf. Something isn't right. No DNA, all white jury, father was a judge, you do the math. Mm. No justice. First black people went through slavery, dealt with chains and whips. He admitted to shooting Trayvon, not guilty verdict, case dismissed. How are we supposed to cope knowing that because of skin color, we won't get a fair trial? But if another race was shot, we would be the first to go down. No peace. It's sad to know that this mother will never again see her son. His life was taken by a wannabe cop with a gun. And the same person who took his life will still walk the streets. Mm. All Trayvon's mother has is a tombstone in six feet. Mm. No justice, no peace. Imagine if it was your son. What would you do? He was doing nothing but LWB. Living while black, like me and you. Yeah. No justice, no, no peace. Right. And the second one that I'm going to do is dedicated to Martin Luther King and my favorite, Fannie Lou Hamer. All right. And all of the people that have come before us that carry the same dream for us to live peacefully. It's called My People. Beautiful, strong, courageous, hardworking. These are the words to describe my people. Born with unique features like high cheekbones and long legs, made to appreciate standing on the shoulders of great ancestors. Built with women's blood, able to carry the weight of the world while wearing a smile. My people, descendants of the great African continent. Skin like ebony or mocha or vanilla chai. Our style is flawless, able to create masterpieces with the fabric the world has thrown at us. Intelligent, one of a kind, bridge builders. We make connections that are everlasting. My brothers, my sisters, we are the caretakers of the earth. We must continue the legacy of those who've come before us. Continue to be the keepers of our brothers and sisters. Lift up the world with one hand while holding on to traditions in the other. My people, able to go through trials and tribulations and come out triumphant. Let us not forget where we all began. On that great African continent as one. <laughs> 